What's up y'all? It's Sean from Team Snag and Whiskers. We're on the Sandy River Reservoir this morning. It's just Ryan and I, aka Snacks. We're going to try to do a little bass fishing. Um, stay tuned. All right, we're starting off. I'm using a spinner bait. Here's my uh, spinner bait of choice. Ryan's throwing a popper. I'm trying to give him something a little different. Top and bottom. Top and bottom. We'll see what's going to happen. We've also got a surprise angler showing up with us here shortly. We're going to pick him up at the dock. Right after work fishing. Yeah. I got a cooler in here if you wanted to put any sort of um, food in there. I just stopped and got a breakfast sandwich and some fried taters. Seven pounder out of my lake. Five pounder going back. Into the creek. I mean, you gotta, we gotta get the skunk out of the boat. <laughs> I know, it's terrible. And then, and and then things will start that, to happen. I thought we'd have had that before you got here. We almost did. Yeah. If I would have known there was a skunk going on, I might not have came. <laughs> Alright, we're two hours into this fishing trip and uh, we haven't got the skunk out the boat. <laughs> we switched to the Texas rig, we switched to the chatterbait. I don't know what to do. What do you think, Ryan? Switch up lures. Switch up lures. Yeah. We're going to try switching up some lures. Alright, we came to Sandy River to catch big fish, so we're going with some big swim baits. we got a shad here, and here's a little tip that I like to use for, I just tied the swim jig on. Using the nail clippers is a lot easier to trim off your excess line after you tie it. Easy peasy. Mm -hmm. oh, that's a nice one. Did you see that hook set? <laughs> All right. Who'd you catch them on? Texas fish. Dark fish. Yeah, it is. Skunk's gone. See, this is why you follow. Is that a bald eagle? Eagle being chased by a little bird? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's cool. 